Hmm, so it seems... Seems someone's been at my place. Halt, there's a bomb hidden in your base. If you want it defused, bring one stack of quartz. Didn't I bring you like two stacks of quartz, dude? Ripping me off. I gave you two, I think. Was it two stacks? I give you a lot. Uh, to my base or else. One of the items placed triggers the bomb. Wow, I love magnetic. I gave you two stacks, I think. Was it about two stacks? I'm not sure. But, uh, yeah, I got stuff around here. <laughs> around here. Oh, what's that? I minimize that. So, let's go ahead and start taking these down. Oh, mother. Mother. <laughs> Let me bring my wall. These don't give you back, right? Oh, they do. Uh, lever. Button. Oh, oh. So, yeah. Whoa, string. Hello. Oh, fuck. Didn't want to break you. Get out of my life. Wait. Where'd my axe go? What the hell? Where's my axe? Did it somehow do the block trick where it goes up? Oh, don't tell me it went all the way up on the roof. Uh, there's a lot of stuff around here. <laughs> uh, where's my axe? I actually want it. Shot it. Yeah. I don't know if it's it went up here. Where'd it go? I don't know. I I had it. And I broke one of these blocks. Uh okay, okay so it was It would be in the house. My, my dirt, oh, pfft. what the hell? I'm sorry, guys. I, <laughs> I'm really sorry if it's been there this whole entire time. I am freaking tired. It's 1.30 in the morning. I, I'm ready to go to bed, so. Oh, what the heck? Hmm. I don't know why seems like I got a lot less frames eh, oh well. than usual. So yeah, I've been, I, I've been pranked, I guess. Like I said, I gave him a crap load of freaking quartz. Where's my quartz? Yeah, because I had, I think I gave him like two stacks or something. I would have sworn it was two stacks. Maybe it was one. But I, I gave him it, so I'm not going to touch any of this. Magnetic, you're defusing this bomb. Which I don't know where you put it, but if there is one. But, uh, but yeah. You're diffusing it, because I already gave you like two stacks, so you're like double diffusing it. You're diffusing it and putting it in your own place for that. Alright, I want to do something. Without breaking my shovel. Give me all that. Alright. So, with the change of snow... Thank you, man. Cool. The change of snow. We're on the uh, the newest snapshot, five A. You obviously you make the blocks and you go one, two, three. I know one more. And now you can barely see it, like in your hand. You have to like swoop down really fast to see it. Shut up! Fucking sheep! How many sheep do I... Did someone breed my sheep? You guys are freaking loud! Shut up! 
Okay, um, where do I want to put this? But anyway, like I said, ooh, actually, I thought about something. Oh, that's cool. You can place it, and you can actually now add more to it, like, and you can actually, like, have it as, like, a a step thing, like that, like, and you go up, up, and you're good. Like, look at that. Do I get him back? Oh, you, you rip-off artist. That's messed up. Like, I, I understand not giving you a, this th this thing in my hand back. But just give me, like, one snowball? What does this give me? Three? Oh, that's f fucked up. That's like a rip-off artist. I'm I'm gonna freaking email Mojang and tell him that this is a rip-off artist. <laughs> uh, but anyway. It, it, it's pretty neat. You could... And actually, you could just place down one layer of snow, and I think, at least that's what uh, Doc said in his video. He says like one layer, and it's basically mob proof. So you don't you could just lay snow down. That's why snow biome's not gonna be perfect if that's true. Or I don't know if there's a difference between uh, crafted and natural snow. I don't know if that's gonna make a difference, and they'll still spawn in snow biomes. But, like, I can cover all this land with snow, if it is true. I haven't actually tested it. <laughs> and, uh, we can find out. Well, I'm not going to find out, but, you know, you guys can confirm it for me or something. But it'd be pretty neat, you know, you just, all you got to do is cover your land with snow. Obviously, you know, you're going to have snow. But, no bombs. And that's freaking awesome. But anyway, not much progress has been made on the, uh, the the town thing. I kind of just been um, in laying out the the kind of outlines of the buildings. So, and I'm actually going to be cutting this episode short. I'm not. I don't think I'm going to edit it now. But uh, I kind of want to update you guys. So yeah, what is it? It's just yeah, five A. I just been kind of farming dirt, kind of getting prepared on the dirt end, and I kind of just made a portal that way that leads to an area I've just been kind of digging out a nice area too but yeah I, I should have snow out here because I had to use the walls that's another thing too I gotta replace this all with quartz because quartz looks a lot better seriously I don't have any snow I have ice damn I must I think I used it all up yeah but yeah this is the, what what happened to all the I thought the grass was already spread. I just kind of laid out the layout of a few buildings. Like I said, and, you know, don't worry guys. You know, everybody I left a comment, your, your house will indeed be made. In one way or another, I'm going to try to get, you know, every comment that you guys left. I'm going to try to get a building made for it. If it's not on this island, or if I have to make more islands all over the ocean, I will do that. But yeah, this is, uh, this isn't even all the dirt. I have like a half a chest half a double chest um, back at where I was digging out all the dirt so I think I have plenty of dirt for right now that should be fine I gotta finish that up and you guys left suggestions of like including some some stone but I didn't feel like it was needed on this side here because obviously it, it turns into dirt right there and we just it, it's just, it's all dirt here so at least on this side here I'm gonna leave it dirt but uh on the other side and wherever there's I see some stone mixed in I'm gonna try to include it obviously on this one too I'm gonna try to you know get some dirt included I'm thinking maybe even some vines but I don't know if I want that overhanging all the way down to the ocean so let me know if you guys think it'd be a good idea to do vines or if it'll just be like oh my god annoying annoying vines so yeah also uh, an update on the Oblivion Let's Play. Uh, I recorded it, and it recorded from the wrong microphone. So I recorded like an hour of Oblivion, so that kind of got delayed. But um, I'm going to be uploading a short clip of that recording, because the, the this one part I recorded in Oblivion, it was it was way too funny that, you know, I, I couldn't recreate it even if I wanted to, and plus it wouldn't be... You know, like, a genuine response to it. It would just me be going like, ooh, ooh. But, uh, look forward to that. It's a, it's gotta be a short clip. It's, like, it's a glitch, I guess, in the game that I 
somehow ran into, and uh, it kind of freaked me out when uh, I didn't, when, you know, I kind of was like, what's going on? And it kind of freaked me out, and I'm just like laughing and just confused. So look forward to that. I'm thinking I might try to get that out today as you guys are seeing this. If not, it'll probably come out later in the day, but uh, fear not. And, uh, yeah, uh, like I said, Oblivion, I am going to get these houses, like I said, it's just, it's 1.30, I actually, I don't want to spend too much time in this, so I do apologize. I know you guys are like, oh, where my GERD, where, where's the videos? You yeah, haven't been uploading any videos, sir, do I have any arrows? I do, sweet. But yeah, I've been kind of uh, busy in smite, you're looking at me, don't look at me. I've been playing a lot of Smite, and there's going to be some projects for Smite coming up too on the channel. I'm going to be uploading uh, a God Spotlight for every God in the game and every God to come in the future. I'm going to be doing God Spotlights. But i gotta, gotta got to get caught up with this current Gods, which there's 29 at the moment. And they're releasing one, hopefully in like two weeks. Uh, they just released Vulcan. Like if any of you guys follow Smite, I'm, I'm, I follow it. And there's a project, a website project that I might be working on that involves Smite. Um, I had to get, I had to get in contact with Hi res to get approved for the API so I can actually directly connect to stuff on that they have like stats, items, gods. Um, I could directly get it from them so that, you know, when I do this website project, it will uh, be updated straight from them. So I don't actually have to go in there myself and update it <laughs> so I could be lazy and just have the website do everything itself but I uh, look forward to that in the future I'll be releasing more details on it let's just say there's not it's, it's a simple website it's just it's gonna be smite it's gonna be uh, it's I'll just tell you guys uh, to end off the episode basically how the website's gonna be is if any of you guys played League of Legends you guys remember in the store um, you would like look at a god and you can actually look at their abilities and then you can click a video that's like a 5 to 10 second clip of their ability. Um, like I said, I don't know if there's any of that right now in any Smite websites or you know, like Smite doesn't have that in game or anything. And I kind of felt like that'd be pretty neat to have. And obviously I want to expand more on it. Um, I was thinking of making also the website kind of like where you can go there. Um, probably this is probably going to be like a different website in its own kind of thing. Um, and what this other website might be is like just to kind of show off counters. If uh, I think the website's called championselect.net. I think you can go there and you basically, it's it for League of Legends and it you just select God and it'll tell you counters and everything for it. And I'm kind of like, you know, this might need something like that. So I'm going to be working on that. And like I said, this other website, just to show off five to ten second clips of the gods' abilities. Just because, like I said, it, it helped me out in League of Legends when I did play it. Where I was like, I was like interested in this god. I'm like, okay, so he's a, he's an AD carry. Um, what does his abilities look like? Like usually, and it's like I'm I buy the god and or I'm gonna try him out because of the the uh, god rotation and um and basically I would you know we're I was like in queue to go play a match and you know I gotta like quickly figure out what these abilities do and it was very helpful just to watch the like five to ten second clip just to just visually see no words no nothing just boom see what the ability does and that really helped me out because i was like i saw what it did i saw what exactly kind of goes on with it i mean obviously you know you can just in game kind of hit k and just read it and just go oh it does this but sometimes the words could be a little bit misleading or it might not fully describe it entirely so you know you'd be like what so i kind of wanted to make a website like that so you Basically, you got every, anybody can go there and be like, I want to see the this like 10 second clip and figure out, you know, all the abilities of this god. And most of the time, you, you either have to watch god spotlights, and those are most of the time people who do god spotlights just to find out the abilities of a god. Um, you usually have to watch them play a match. So they'll like usually at the beginning of the match kind of hit K and just say, Oh, this ability does this. And that they, they don't actually show it off. And then you have to wait until they actually get they are facing their opponent and doing everything and then you get to see the abilities and so i kind of felt like that's kind of 
it's it's good to see, but you know, I wanted a place where you could just go there, you get what you want to see, and I want it to be kind of more to it. And I also want a place where people can get their smite streams kind of exposed. Obviously, the site at the beginning, I'm probably not going to have that, but maybe later on, I will release that. So people who live stream smite, I'll have like a little place section of the website that you know spotlights them, and we'll have like maybe like a featured streamer that's on. And then we'll swap them out with new streamers that come on, stuff like that. So we can get you know new new streamers some kind of exposure. I'd, it's definitely nice. So I think that's gonna do it for this episode. I know I kind of just started rambling and on into Smite, but it's a it's a big project. And you know if you guys haven't checked out Smite, check it out. If you're into League of Legends, check out Smite. Um, if if you're the type that's like Ermagerd, Smite is copying League of Legends. Uh, that's your opinion. I I don't agree and I don't disagree. I, I find that both games are kind of their own thing. Obviously, they're both MOBAs, and, you know, League of Legends can't just be the only MOBA. There needs to be competition, and there needs to be other games, because, you know, everybody has different tastes. There's people out there that don't like League, like myself. I don't hate it, but I'm just, I'm not a huge fan of the camera, kind of like that. And obviously, there's other people that would disagree with me and be like, I love that. It's kind of like preference, and that's why Smite, I'm auto-walking with that. I let go of the W key. Um, it's preference, like, you know. And Smite, if you guys don't know about it, it's a fir it's kind of a third-person MOBA. It's not the overhead camera that you just got locked on on top of you. Or, well, you can unlock it and move it around, but, you know, the overhead camera. Um, it's basically a third person that you control behind you. So it's essentially like this, like in Minecraft. I'm, I'm facing right behind me. And, you know, you do your abilities and you shoot them and you do stuff, stuff like that. And it's like a third person just like this and you control the camera exactly like this. It's not the overhead camera to where, you know, it's just locked up here and all you see is your character and, you know, and you... What the hell? Oh, it like zooms in on you. But yeah, it's like that, you know, and then you just click with your mouse and stuff like that. So it's a very interesting game. Guys, check it out. It has indeed gone to open beta. It's completely open. It's not closed. You don't need a beta key. It's, you just go to the website, download it, make an account, and you can play. So, go, you know, like I said, check it out. And, uh, you know, you guys can add me on Smite, too. And I'll play some... Well, actually, I can't. Fuck. They uh, reintroduced that, like, when you're low-level, you can only play with other low-level players. So, I can't actually join you guys until you hit, like, level 5. But, like I said, feel free to add me. My, my in-game name on Smite is Tobikus, as my YouTube you guys are free to add me, play, you know, try out the game. I, Like I said, I would absolutely love to play with some of you guys, play some games. But sadly enough, I can't do much until you guys hit level 5. And then, then we're able to play some matches. But then, sadly enough, if you guys play with me, you're probably going to get paired up with some higher, higher up level people. So, probably won't be fun. But anyway, I think I've been rambling on way too much. So, I'm going to leave you guys with that. More Minecraft Smite stuff to come, Oblivion Let's Play, I gotta re-record that, but I'm gonna be releasing the funny clip today. And like I said, these houses are gonna get made, there's just, uh, there's so much on my plate and uh, other stuff is on my plate right now at the moment, so I'm, I do apologize. But look forward to it, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!